All right, I want to do a quick video real quick, uh, testing out that wazoo needle, along with the uh, other options I have for, you know, a wrist type kit. Um, I'll show you real quick the uh, one with the clamp uh, is showing in this direction, it's the north south line. You can see the needle is basically uh, just a couple degrees off. Uh, the regular small one that you would keep like in a, this is actually the one from a micro seed kit, is a few degrees off, and uh, I don't know if you can see the screen on that too well or not with the glare, but uh, the uh, north-south line on the compass, there you go, you can see it now I think, still a little bit of a glare. But it's basically uh, showing just a little bit less of a tilt. Um, they were all within, you know, marginal than each other. But, uh, you know, I always want a full compass in my kit because of this. You're going to get a decent line with the uh, clamshell type liquid filled compass for uh, a kit. The uh, button compass, the standard button compass that's not the liquid gel filled. You're going to get it okay, but it's still a couple degrees off. The the phone compass is fairly decent, and then probably the least uh, accurate is the needle. I still do have a decent north-south line just by floating the uh, needle on top of the um, leaf there. It is going back all, every single time back to the north-south line, magnetizing it just using the you know pair of jean material. So four different ways to get north-south, and they're all pretty or much within a couple degrees of each other. I will be back with more videos soon. Thank you.